I'm still feeling a little unsure this morning. There he is. <laughs> but I see the women that I'm on the date with today. How's everyone doing? I could be at my lowest of lows, but as soon as I'm with these women, it brings me back and it brings me to the reason why I'm here. I'm just the luckiest guy ever. How's everyone feeling? Good. So good. Good. Excited to be in Canada. We're in Montreal, y'all. We are in Montreal, y'all. There it is. There's the South. <laughs> Uh, if I'm being completely honest, I was really excited coming in this week, and then today, a lot of emotions hit just because I'm finding out more and more how hard it is for me to express my feelings, and that's, it just scares me. But I really still want to be intentional with our time, and I don't even know what we're getting into. I'm just glad that Jesse's gonna have a really fun day for us playing. Yes. Yeah. Joey seems very overwhelmed with emotions right now, but I think Montreal's a perfect place to kind of show him that, you know, we can have a good time together and just not have any worries. Entries, midi, votre amour pour city vielle et rendezvous à ma boutique souvenir préféré. So we get to go to a boutique and pick out a souvenir. Yeah. All right, let's do it. Let's go this way. I am excited to explore Montreal with Joey and the seven other women here. I feel like it looks like this one here. Oh. <laughs> I honestly just want to have a great time. We're turning over a new maple leaf, so. Oh, oh, is this this for us? Welcome Hi. to Montreal. Thanks. And actually, I have something. Uh, I hope to strengthen mine and Joey's connection, get those little moments in the group date that I can. I'm really excited to see what we're doing and like learn a little bit of the lingo. Bonjour. Bonjour. And qu'est-ce que vous faites à Montréal? Yeah. What are you doing in Montreal? Uh, you know, on a date. <laughs> all of us. All the beautiful all girls. All of us are, yeah. I'm a lucky guy. Alors, répétez avec moi. Je t'aime. Je, Je t'aime. Mon amour. Mon amour. Voulez-vous une rose? Voulez-vous une rose? Voulez the French language, it seems like it's always beautiful and romantic, but I, I don't sound like that when I say it. I love this date has started off so strong. We are just enjoying each other's company, and there is this exciting vibe. I'm at the point where I can say that I might be falling in love with some of these women. The journey along the way is going to get more difficult, but I'm doing my best. That's what I can keep saying. Oh, hello. Oh. Bonjour. Bonjour. Looks like you've made it to Jesse's favorite restaurant in Montreal, Garde Manger. Has anybody ever had poutine? Or poutine. You've had poutine before. Have you ever made it? No. Ooh. Want to make a poutine? Yeah. Want to yes. try it? All right. Come on over. All right. So poutine is really made up of French fries, cheese curds, and what can be described as delicious brown sauce. So Jesse dropped off a whole bunch of ingredients. Feel free to get creative if you want. Begin. Begin. Yeah. Can I fry you? Fry me. Give me in there. Pretty hot. I'm gonna do a sweet. Oh my god, I'm dropping it. See, I was scared of the pineapple. Oh, you're going chocolate? You're doing something different over there. Pineapple, chocolate, apple, and chocolate sauce. Pineapple and pizza. There you go. What is happening? The person that's making the worst decision right now is Jen. That is not how I would make a poutine, but Jen's doing really well today, giving little moments that are making me feel special. Might as well do it. Little touch. <laughs> There's so you much go. going on. Out of 10, what are we thinking? Really? Oh, four. Four out of 10. When she talks to me, it feels like we're the only ones there. That's hard to do in a crowd with seven other women. She always finds a way to do that, and it just feels real. I think you got the wrong bike. Maybe. You I'm glad you're liking it. <laughs> so? With Joey, it's just very hard to see him interact with other women. My last date was a one-on-one, -on -one and you know, just you know, him and I. So it's been a minute since I've been in this setting. So I think that it just like a readjustment. Thank, Thank you so you. much. Thanks, guys. I mean, it's continuing to get harder. All of these girls are forming connections. I think for me, like I just need time, and like in a group setting like today, I didn't really get that. Yay! Dance. Who wants to dance with me? As you like sneak in now, that's what I thought. I thought that was coming. Yeah, I'm just trying to get a dance with Joey, and everyone's kind of swooping in in front of me, and it's definitely just, it's just getting harder. Sorry, can I see you? Can I see you in a second? I just am tired of these group dates, and I just don't really understand why I haven't had a one on one. Dance circle, big one. Yeah. 
There you go. The energy is a little weird because it feels like there's a million girls trying to, you know, vie for his attention. At one point, I think we were dancing around Joey. It felt very culty. I feel like I'm about to be executed. I would say this is probably my least favorite date I've been on just because it's, like, very difficult to navigate. Thank you. Oh, you have something for me now. It definitely is getting harder and harder. It just feels like he's not giving me any attention, honestly. <laughs> this group date, this is the hardest. Literally. One. This one's like hard. I don't understand. I'm just like getting like kind of stuck in the, you know, the shadows, it feels like. I don't like feeling like this. Like I just feel insecure and I don't, I'm not an insecure person. I hate this. I just feel like I'm overthinking. It just makes me want to like shut down and walk away. But it is very um, different, for sure. Yeah! There you go. Yeah! That's right. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, great. Keeper. Who's keeper? I am sick of these group dates. Oh, it's God. just so weird, because whenever I'm talking to him one-on-one, -on -one, I feel amazing. Then in the group settings, I feel forgotten. <laughs> This week is make or break. Um, he's really figuring out where he stands in his relationships and tonight. Hopefully we can just really connect and I need to just get his attention, do something big.